This is the Design 8 or the Lucid Cast On. I sometimes refer to it as the Double 8 Cast On just because uh, that's what I think of when I'm working it. You'll understand more about that in a moment when I'm showing you the Cast On. This loom is the Universal S loom from Cindy Wood Crafts. The color pegs are not used when you're working a double panel, which is what we'll be doing today. So when we are doing our cast on, we will skip the color pegs, only using the beige or white pegs. The first step is to put your slip knot on your first peg. Now this is the sti basic stitch is the same as the E wrap, but because we're working double panel, we're using the peg on the top and its corresponding peg at the bottom. So when we do an E wrap around these, it looks a little like an eight. See? So we've got the slip knot on our first peg. We're going to bring it directly across to the second peg, wrap around, we're going to cross in the middle, and then bring it up to the top. And we're going to do it again. Bring the working yarn back to the top, and wrap around the top peg, cross over in the middle and bring it around to the bottom peg, and cross over. Now we're going to bring the bottom loop up and over the top loop, And we've cast on to our first pegs. We tighten just a little bit. Since we finished off at the bottom, we're going to bring it to the top for the next set of pegs. Around two. Since I am casting on counterclockwise, I'm going to bring the yarn to the counter, wrap the yarn around the peg counterclockwise at the top and clockwise at the bottom counterclockwise at the top, clockwise at the bottom. Bring the working yarn up and over. Tighten. Cast on our next set. What I call the double, the reason I call this the double eight it's because I have an eight at the bottom, and then I'm going to double up and do one more at the top. Up and over, up and over, and tighten. And you notice I skipped a color peg. We'll continue wrap doing the design eight or loose it. Or the double wrap if you're double eight if you're me around all the number of pegs that we have in our pattern. And once we're done, we're ready to work our, our stitch and we will go back the other direction. Now that we've finished casting on our design eight or loose it cast on, which I also refer to as a double eight cast on sometimes, we're ready to work our first row of this very skinny little double knit scarf. We're going to bring our working yarn around the first peg at the top, crossing over to wrap the one at the bottom, and you see how it makes our figure eight. Bring it to the inside top peg, around and to the bottom and around. And we'll work all the way back for our first row. This is the figure eight stitch and you're ready to knit bottom bottom loop, excuse me, over the top. Okay, and that's it. That's how you work this stitch on the, the Universal S loom.